No, I didn't grow up with money. We, 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 we weren't rich by any means, but uh, I, I knew I wasn't going to college. I knew that wasn't a reality, and I didn't really want to go to college. One of the things that I was very lucky in my life with is I knew exactly what I wanted to do. From the time I was a young age, I knew I wanted to be in the fight business, and people thought I was crazy. I worked in Boston at a place called the Boston Harbor Hotel. I was a bellman in there. I was 19 years old. I made good money. You know, there's some guys that get those jobs, and those are the type of jobs they, they, they you know, they're Stay lifers. They, they want those jobs forever. And it's a good job. It's not yeah. a bad job. Yeah. It just wasn't for me. And uh, I was literally standing in the lobby one day, and I'm like, what the hell am I doing here? What am I doing here? This isn't me. This isn't what I want. And I walked out the front door, and one of my good friends, he's still one of my good friends today, says, uh, what are you doing? I said, I'm, I'm quitting. When you get out of bed every morning, right? You get up out of bed, life is standing right there to kick you in the face. Ready, leg cock, ready to go to kick you in the face. Because every day when you get up, bad shit's coming at you. Forget about work, your personal life, everything. Car don't start, the this, the that. Life is ready to get you, you know? And you gotta get up and you gotta fight through that bullshit every day, you have to. You gotta fight through all the shit that life throws at you. Then you get to a point where life's throwing a bunch of shit at you, and now work's throwing a bunch of shit at you. You know, your, your business that you have to fight for every day. And you have to get up, and you have to have that to get up and fight every day, man. Go for it. Just go for it. Believe me, I'm living proof that it can happen. First of all, when, when you have a business idea, um, there's always going to be detractors and people that think, you know, it won't work. You're always going to have those people around you and in your life, even when you're successful, believe me. It gets worse when you're successful. Anything you do positive in your life and anything that's huge, it will immediately be surrounded by negativity, yeah. right? Immediately. Get ready for it because no matter how successful you become, one thing never goes away. Negativity. <laughs> Their opinion means nothing. Give it up there. It is literally an opinion, it's negative bullshit, and it means nothing to you. It doesn't mean anything, it doesn't affect, unless you're the type, sick, twisted type of person like me that likes to let it fuel you. You let it, it's like your, you know, it's like your fuel, and, and, and other than that, it's useless, it means nothing. Do your thing, stay on your course, stay focused. And, and, and keep your eye on the prize and, and, and everything comes together. If you're looking for fuck you money, you're in the wrong place already. You already know you're not in the right place. I can't stand three day weekends. I hate three day weekends, man. I'm like, man, I'm, I want Monday to come again. That's how much I love what I do. If that's not your mentality every weekend when you're at, at home, like you're dreading Monday, man, stop. Stop and get another job because you're in the wrong place. That, that, that's not healthy for you. And at the end of the day, it's really about that you love what you're doing and it's about the journey, the people you're doing with it, that you're having fun, you're getting up every day and, and you're all working toward the same goal, whatever it might be. It's a very fulfilling feeling. It really is a very fulfilling feeling because I've been where most people have been. I, I've been in the, in, in the shitty job that you're just trying to pay your bills and you're trying to make ends meet and, and, and you're miserable. You're doing it because you have to do it because you have to pay your bills because you need money. Once you break out of that and you find what it is you truly love to do, it's really not work. It's, it's actually fun and you enjoy every day of your life. From what I've learned and as I look back on my life, Everything in life is about timing. Yes. It really is about timing. The right time, the right place, the right everything. And, and I also believe that you create your own timing yes. in life too. What's the worst thing that can happen if you try? If, if the day that I walked out of that hotel, right, and I went to do this, it doesn't work out. I can go back and be a bellman again yeah. whenever I want to. You can always go back and do that. The worst part is not trying. Yeah. You have to try. Nobody's ever going to do anything without trying. It's never the right time. It's never the right time. It's like, I can't now. I, 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 I got this truck I just bought. I got payments on this friggin' thing. You know, I, I got this. If you do that to yourself, you'll never do anything. Forget the truck. Forget this. Forget that. Go for it. Just go for it. Believe me, I'm living proof that it can happen.